It's a bird, it's a plane. Oh, it is a plane. In fact, lots of planes. This is sort of an odd sight just north of Gray Bull, Wyoming. Have you ever driven by and wondered what this collection of old planes was? It's the Museum of Flight and Aerial Firefighting. This outdoor admission-free museum was founded in 1987 and incorporated in 1992. There are many museums dedicated to aviation history, but this one is unique in that it focuses on the aircrafts used to fight forest fires. The technology to spot and fight fires has drastically improved. In the 1920s, they tried dumping water-filled beer kegs out of the back seat of a single-engine airplane. Now they can precisely drop fire retardant material on the front lines with air tankers. This museum contains dozens of the last remaining World War II bombers, numerous types of helicopters, and the KC-97, the world's largest air tanker. They restore and retire historical planes, such as four of the last remaining flying PB-4Y2 planes used against the Japanese in the South Pacific. This is certainly not your typical museum, as there are no signs or guided tours. What a unique collection of flight history, as humans have battled Mother Nature's fierce fires and fought world wars. Stop by and check it out for yourself. From the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Mae Smith, exploring the nature of Wyoming. Thank you.